back in the building back like we never left it's the maryland for crypto show it's your boy sean prince in the building and your boy mr make it happen LJ yeah. dread city already you already know what it is man we back like we never left and we got a great show for y'all today we're gonna talk a little bit about this fed now this incoming united states recession yeah. a little bit of xrp sec case hey yo know. man run that intro bro run that right. intro with the new out with the old i'm telling the future is being foretold be our currency ain't backed by gold now watch out this new revolution unfold everything hidden in plain sight it's your boy city freezer on it down with maryland for crypto y'all know what time it is y'all want to get your money right fuck with it all day much love aloha to maryland for crypto aloha shout out to the big homie maryland for crypto out here too old smoking with legends that's how we do legends out here all day the weapon xrp the ammo xrp the keys ripple the piano ripple the cowboy xrp the lasso this financial reset gonna be a fiasco fiasco is what it's gonna be because this financial reset is going down with or without you so you mm-hmm. better get with it or you're gonna get lost yeah i mean it's it's crazy out here in the streets right now Too the united crazy. states might actually run out of money what? like what like what is happening Running this is out of never money? happened in the history of the united states in the they history of the dollar raise that debt ceiling they're not gonna raise the they're debt ceiling raise they can't come to an agreement on whether or not they want to raise the debt ceiling so what's gonna happen to it, of course yeah. they can't but you because know what though the drama has the build the, the drama suspense. has begun <laughs> the suspense has begun and really i'm gonna keep it a thousand this is a maryland for crypto show i right. think it's a big psyop they mm-hmm. create the problem to give you the solution right we've seen this happen before COVID vaccine we've seen this happen before <laughs> this this isn't something new this is at all know, and you know this is what's going on we got the fed now program that's getting ready to launch here soon yeah in july and if you keep falling for the same tricks the same mm-hmm. play that they keep mm-hmm. doing cause a problem wait for this wait for the create you know, the solution yeah wait for the the people to rise to up rise and, and be scared and then yeah. fear and then they come in with the solution oh, we're, which they've already had planned for years this already. has been in the making the in writings the making. have been on the wall and if you've been following maryland for crypto you'd have been able to keep up you'd have been abreast with the c you'd have been abreast of what's going down with the cbdc right with the fed now with the cashless Central society Central with the dollar Central. dying with the wand taking over we've been talking about this since 2021 20, 2020 for crypto man listen it's almost like we beating a dead horse out here yeah it's like you know and it's just you everything still don't believe to us to fruition so it's like what are you what are you guys doing why yeah. aren't you paying attention why aren't you listening <laughs> but listen if they if they don't raise this debt ceiling right mm-hmm. the government could technically shut down as soon as june 1st and this has never happened before. The government has never defaulted on its debt. So yeah. if this does happen, unemployment rates are going to be skyrocketing through the roof. It's going to be a big decline in the GDP, which will pretty much put us in a recession into twenty into the year 2020-25. Right. So, I mean, this is this is huge news, people. It, like, it, this it. is, it's like, what are we going to do? Raising interest rates won't raise the debt ceiling. You know what I mean? Inflation is going crazy. Through the roof. Through the roof. And this man right here, he controls it all. Yeah, and uh, and in about a month after that, the United States dollar is going to change forever as right. we know it. Because you know we're always already coming off the petrodollar. Exactly. So that that right there, everybody's leaving the United States, leaving the. A United. lot of businesses are going abroad. Right. There are different countries, the BRICS nations. They already said right now it's about thirty different countries already trying to align with the BRICS nations to wow. come off. The United States Let's come off the dollar. dollar and switch to the one. So, yeah. So that is crazy because they're getting stronger and stronger and stronger. Meaning the United States dollar is getting weaker, weaker and, and weaker, weaker and weaker. And, and, weaker. Then, and this is a problem. This is a big problem for a lot of people. And when when the CB when the CBDC program of Fed now is introduced, it's going to be set to be launched in July. Right. And I mean, at that point, you know, we're going to be in a situation where everything will be tracked and traced mm-hmm. all of your payments will be um on the on the blockchain or in the fed now system right. you know there's going to be i know china has different stipulations i don't know if we're going to follow suit i wouldn't see why we wouldn't but like you have a certain amount of time to spend your money if you you'll be only be able to allow to buy certain things mm-hmm. like they're going to have complete control over our finances right. if we let them 
and if we don't hedge ourselves with cryptocurrency cryptocurrency solves this issue it solves this problem right and it keeps the the people it keeps the people at, but at there's only the best certain interest. currencies that solve these problems talk to them not your mean coin not those mean coin now granted listen. you can make a couple dollars on the mean yeah. coin now. Uh, yeah yeah i mean wrong. listen listen people <laughs> out here making making some, big bread making bread some of that pepe le pew <laughs> you making money off that pepe i did hear somebody the made pee-pee. some let me see that. There we go. Twenty-seven dollars. <laughs> Stop it. Into five point five million. That's Pepper. crazy. Super crazy. What An anomaly. Right. And we and we now talk look. about utility. <laughs> utility. Utility. <laughs> utility. <laughs> utility. Like we always preaching it, but right. so I mean we damn. getting wrecked out here. We, we getting, getting wrecked. Man, but granted, it is a bear market. It's a bear market. It's to be expected, and we knew mm-hmm. that these prices would come down. And we've we've pretty much uh, been been abreast Listen, of we, this. We don't we're top stick it. to our guns. And, stick to and the do goal. Do this the right way. Absolutely. By investing Absolutely. in utility coins. Absolutely. Investing in gold, and making sure we have extra money on the side to buy the dips. Buy those dips, dollar that's, cost. That, average. That, that's our method. Because we regardless, don't we don't go into meme coins. Yeah, we we, we really don't. I go mean, into we meme see people coins. making bread out there, but and we're I'm, not and I'm chasing happy for you. Out here. We're not chasing it because at the end of the day, those pump and dumps are real, right. and there's so many of them in the crypto. If space. you don't get it early, guess what? You're you, left holding the bag. You left holding the bag, and you left become the liquidity bag. for the person right. that did get in early. That did get in early, you're left holding the bag. So again, you know, with the XRP SEC lawsuit, you know, with the SEC trying to have sanctions on everything, um, you know, there's going to be a time where a lot of these meme coins and a lot of the, I guess you could say all the fun stuff that happens in the crypto space, it's going to die out. They're not going to be able to pass regulations. We're going to have some sort of clarity. And I would say more than 50 to 60% of the market will be obsolete at that point. Not to say that it could happen to Pepe or Doge or Shiv, but it's just... We want you guys to be able to highlight the utility tokens that are go- already in use, that are already solving worldly issues, mm-hmm. and that's going to make a, a there's going to be a part of this financial reset. Right. It's going to be a part of this fourth industrial revolution. Right, and so, and, which makes sense, man. Because like I said, if we're not doing the right things now, we're going to miss that generational wealth. When when they flip that switch, and utility actually is the mainstream. You know what I mean? Which the money's flowing in. Which XRP after they lose this? I mean, after they, after win, they win, after they win this uh, lawsuit, talk to them. They will be the only, once again, the only coin with regulatory clarity. Sure. And if they're the only coin, guess what? All the f- money is gonna flow into XRP, yep. Bitcoin, maybe Ethereum. If Ethereum. they don't get, if they since they already got their little free pass. And those three Ethereum coins, got the free pass. Yeah, they hey, they, the they pass. paid to play, and I can't yeah, knock it. I cannot all. knock the hustle because they paid to play. They paid to play, right. and they and they have clarity, and they're able. I mean, Ethereum is pretty much driving the market right now. I don't want people to forget that a lot of the market is here. A lot of things are happening through Ethereum. Ethereum is a staple hold, is the mother of all altcoins. So make sure you have Ethereum in your portfolio. I know that the scalability issues that hopefully should be solved within the next three to five years but regardless ethereum is going to be here to stay right because so much of the crypto market is driven through their on and off ramps and through that blockchain right absolutely definitely definitely absolutely so i mean i mean what a great time to be in the crypto space and in this bear market is when million millions of dollars are made right. crypto isn't going anywhere people not at all it's only expanding listen and it's only sure. getting larger. Look, look, look at look at the companies look that at the are use using case. blockchain. We right? got Hyundai, yep, Nissan, Gucci, down to the socks. You got like YouTube, Big Papa. You got Gap, Hennessy, NFL Network. You know what I mean? Visa, Time. You know what I mean? The Knicks, Audi, Porsche, Even they just took Ford, their Nestle, H and M. You know what I mean? KFC. You getting chicken on the blockchain, ladies and gentlemen. Chicken on the blockchain. Netflix, Instagram, <laughs> Ralph Lauren, the Polo. Let's go. These companies, ladies and gentlemen, are using cryptocurrency. All right, and and they're using it to make their company faster, better, stronger, more more uh, payment what? solutions, yeah, payment solutions, scalability, scalability, like all that is going on, ladies and gentlemen. And 
people are like, oh, crypto's fake. Yeah, don't buy into it. Don't use it. Well, why not? If these companies, these major companies that you're buying, because you buy Gucci, you buy Ralph Lauren, you, you buy, you know what I mean, Ford. Track and Trace. You know what I mean? You want to bring it back again? Because you guys are buying, you guys are buying Heineken. I go drink with some of y'all every day. Y'all drinking Heineken. Starbucks, you ladies, you guys are using Starbucks every day. Y'all got your own cards. Y'all, y'all, y'all getting points. I mean, Web three is going to be revolutionary so, once these, uh, once everything is is connected and, right. and the data can be can be tracked, mm-hmm. and and that blockchain is going to get its use case that it was invented to to do or what so, it was yeah. made for what it was made to do. I mean, the whole world is going to be changed. We see it happening before our eyes. People. Right? They're they're literally sh- shilling you all this nonsense. Look over here. Look over here. And guess what they're doing? They're building a whole new financial system behind your back using blockchain if technology. you're not paying attention and if you're, if you're not paying attention if you're not woke you're gonna get left behind yep. and when we say left behind it's gonna we're not saying you're not gonna be able to invest in it but you're not gonna be able to invest in it at ground bottom prices right where, where xrp is at 33 cents or 43 cents right now and or whatever it is right now with under 50 cents and guess what when when you finally get it and you're finally able to invest in this ten dollars poor coin or twenty dollars or thirty dollars or even fifty dollars, then you're gonna look back like where was I when I had a chance to make generational wealth, generational wealth, and change when I was able to your get outcome. into this at groundbreaking, change your tax you know what I mean? Points. I so, mean it's it's crazy, young guys. I just want to reiterate, crypto is not going anywhere. It's not going nowhere. It's here to stay, folks. It's not. It's and right now, 2023 is the time to invest in it. Yes. The market is down. The cycle is coming. The halvings next year, 2024. March. Yeah. March of 2024. And that's when the Bitcoin will deflationary. It will become a deflationary asset. Well, it is a deflationary asset, but it will cut off a big support, a big part of the supply. The prices will skyrocket. Yeah. And, and this will bring up all the altcoins. Yeah. Meme coins. It's when oh, lives are changed, people. Right. This is when and lives. We are try changed. to change ours for the best. I mean, the industry is always expanding. It's always getting larger. Right. And you know, just to give you guys a big example of this, Mastercard is making a whole lot of waves and a whole lot of noise in this in the space right now. It's going full crypto with this new crypto credentials tier, where it provides a foundation for financial institutions, for governments, and crypto players that are looking to transfer money or digital assets as a set standard to adhere to. So this, I mean, this is huge, people. MasterCard's, MasterCard is a big payment portal. And for this new system that's coming in, this crypto secure system that's gonna be interoperable with over 2,400 exchanges. I mean, this is this is yeah. huge, this is huge. And, and what I don't get now, this is just me speaking, Mm-hmm. Because I, I'm a big uh, advocate. I'm a big advocate for uphold, <laughs> and I'm pretty yeah. pissed at you right now, uphold. Yes, we are. You cut off Not only him. my uphold debit card, and right. you cut off my virtual card, which was already being used by Mastercard. Right, and so we were using happened? it, man. We liked our, uh, we loved our, our uphold, up our card because we got our points back. Our, our we refund. got our XRP yep. rewards. rewards. <laughs> we were, we, we you know, getting, we was living the good life with the uphold man, card. Man, like fifty dollars was already XRP being rewards. used with, uh, with, with. with Mastercard. So swipe, I don't get what happened swipe. there. I don't know what happened. Again, ran out by by Gary, the U.S. and the Gensler's and, and all of that. This guy right here, <laughs> this guy right here, is making everything worse, not better. I don't know, Mr. What's going MIT, on Mr. I teach courses for MIT. I'm teaching people about, but I've never used crypto. I don't have no crypto ever. I've ne- all my holdings are are backed by uh brown and swab <laughs> <laughs> remember you, they were questioning them on uh on, on the uh when they had him on the court oh what yeah a, um oh my god i can't even think we I mean, he just was in congress was, yeah it was, it was, it was a con- have congressional you ever, meeting have, yeah, yeah congressional meeting have you ever bought i've never bought crypto before so you're teaching a class to a bunch of mit students and you've never used crypto before. But you're teaching, shit. Right. But you're teaching <laughs> this class, me, though, to a bunch of, you know what I mean, smart MIT. They all got 4.0s. They're all top of their class. Mm-hmm. They're all listening to Mr. Gary Gensler because he is that man. Supposedly, he is the chosen one. But he you've never used crypto. So how are you He's teaching something that bag. you've never done, used, tried before? But you're teaching this thorough class to these up 
outstanding, outstanding. And, and, and he folks. knows what he's doing. Right. He knows what he's doing. Right. And and what I and you know, we we're realists here on the Metal for Crypto show. So I think what's gonna happen is of course XRP. I personally believe XRP is gonna mm-hmm. win this case. Yeah. I think um the SEC is still not gonna have clarity on when it comes to what when it comes to cryptocurrency in the United States. So I think Gensler is gonna have to step down. They're gonna have to bring somebody else in, a, a different expert that's gonna be be able to uh, to navigate this space better. And that's when they'll come with the clarity when the Fed now is in full effect okay. and the, the the CBDC is in full effect. We're gonna we're gonna use CBDCs. We're gonna be using this yeah. Fed now program. Yeah, this Fed now is this gonna, is be, gonna be secure and and yeah. this will be uh, uh, the new dollar pretty right. much. So I believe in the Fed now. Because, welcome yeah, to the change. Now you're able to. Our banks and stuff are now able to custody your assets. Trust us. Don't worry about Coinbase and 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 uh, Binance and and Uphold. Come to JP JPM. And Come to you know, Yeah. Come to Navy Come to Bank Fed. of America. Stay with the banks yeah. that are insolvent. You know, Goldman Sachs. Just the other day, I we saw can, something we at the you. bank that was very alarming. What? Um, I went to the ATM. See, I. I don't take money out the bank. I put it in the bank so I can mm-hmm. buy more crypto. That's right. another story for another day. So down. I go to the bank like I normally do. I'm putting in some money so I could purchase some more assets. Mm-hmm. And I saw a little disclaimer on the ATM that I never seen before. Right. And it said, due to shortages, ATM may not be able to provide money on your withdrawal. Stop it. That's crazy. Yo. <laughs> That's crazy. Listen. That's great. Never the have I, and America. they just slid it in there in small, small, in small yeah, print, really sitting on the top of eight. Took a picture of that. So hey, I really should have. I'm gonna go back and yeah, I'm gonna, we'll back. have it for you we'll for the next, next episode, episode so you can see. Yeah. I'm not making this shit up, yeah, man. Bank of America has been it's crazy closing ATMs all across, like literally the ATM at the mall, right? Mm-hmm. Been going there for years. Went back. I'm like, you know what? Let me just. I need to grab some money. The whole ATM was out the wall and they bricked it up mm. like literally like there was no like you couldn't even like they painted over and everything and i've got to, i parked and stuff a while wow, looking at the wall like what's happening what the, like what's happening? i thought it was like one of those hidden walls like i pushed through and like it's gonna open up or something I'm like nope all oh, they took the atm out they put new brick in painted the wall pretty and stuff like it was never there before like man, man you have to come inside now we no longer have the atm cashless society is on the horizon people so i mean you better hedge yourself against it and hey if you stick with the maryland for crypto show we're going to tell you what assets you need to invest in we're going to tell you how to do it how to access these on and off ramps with these different exchanges because now like they're really trying to take our off ramps off yeah uphold was an off ramp off was an off ramp yeah i mean voyager was off ramp they went obsolete they went insolvent all we have now is what coinbase and um, we got coinbase crypto.com and crypto.com what you said crypto.com you need to have have at least 4k in the crow token in order to get your crypto.com debit card really Yes, and then, and then you can use it like a they can use it like a regular debit card. You have to have four thousand and four thousand crow, Stop. which is equal to about two to four k. I don't know what it is. Well, I know when I looked into it, it was four k. Now with the bear market, it might be a little cheaper, cheaper right? Cause but because crow has dropped, but yeah, we're looking at about four k just to get their debit card. Just get the debit but card. honestly, man, I feel like it's worth it. I, I mean, feel like it's worth it just because I personally like to spend my my assets straight from my account so right. you know i i was using my uphold card every i would use my uphold card more than i use my debit card from my bank right because the, the my, rewards i was getting yeah, i still from got my, my virtual card oh yeah you got that virtual card but go yeah. ahead try to use it we'll I'm see just, if it works <laughs> it ain't working no right. more jack as of end as of end of april Look. That card is done. Oh, they can't even see. We can't even see. We got the uh, the, the flashing lights. Yeah. We got there you the go. There you go. Yeah, you can see the little the little, uh, little outlook, the little outline of it. You feel right. me, man? That card got us through everything, man. Uh, the card got us through everything, man. I'm really upset that they discontinued that, but that's part of the game, man. So you got to make sure you head yourself against all of these different. Just tapping it. Just tapping it. Tapping like, it. Going. Man. What happened to you today? Yeah, Bitcoin, man. XRP, Should I use ETH? Should I use some USD? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna use a little Digicoin today. Yeah, yeah, man. It was <laughs> real. It was, it was fun while it lasted, man. <laughs> <laughs> right. People were like, what? You're using crypto? Yes. Uh, how are you paying? Crypto. I'll be paying with XLM. They're like, what? What? <laughs> what? Well, what, what do you mean? Don't worry about uh, it. I got you. You might know it as Stellar. Bing. 
What? What is stellar? Stellar lumens. You don't know stellar lumens. Yeah, hey, man, it's crazy, man. But you know, it's it, it's part of the game. You got to be right. able to to navigate that effectively, man. But you know, on, even on top of that, there's still a lot more innovation happening in the industry right now. Twitter mm-hmm. is doing some big things big with their things. new um payment portal and oh man everything that's about to happen with crypto and the eToro partnership i mean that's a huge huge step for the space right now and yeah like twitter you're gonna be able to now what um make phone calls payments you're gonna be able to uh to purchase crypto yeah shop off uh twitter everything like twitter's gonna be a powerhouse thing like they uh elon musk said he wanted to be like uh wechat yeah. WeChat, you can do everything. Like you can literally, you don't have to get off WeChat for nothing. But now, he wants to turn Twitter into X.com or whatever Twitter X.com or whatever he wants to be, and it's gonna be just like WeChat. Like literally, you're going. What do you say? Just, just copy WeChat. Copy WeChat. <laughs> I mean, he, he has a video just saying it. Like, uh, I mean, I the mean, guy's a smart man, smart businessman. <laughs> You know, I don't necessarily say I agree with all his tactics because because um I feel like loyalty loyalty is in my eyes is big in the business world. And for him to kind of shun um the CEO of Binance on that deal, because this deal was not supposed to be made with eToro, this deal is oh. supposed to be made with Binance. Right. And that would have been even better for the crypto space. But it is, it is what it is. It is what it no, is. You know what? F Binance. That's they, how you feel right now. Yeah, because your Binance you kicked right us off. Remember, Binance, you know, you see, you wasn't you wasn't in the crypto back. Right, I, talk to me. Talk but, to yeah, me. Yeah, Binance, this is the OG man. He put Binance me on to the game. Kicked us off and said, sent us all emails saying, "Look, you don't get your stuff off within two weeks because we are no longer, uh, you know, what I mean, doing uh, customer service and and we're servicing the United States customers no more. So you all have to go to Binance US." And you know, because Binance that's was very true. Binance was the true OG. That's you can buy true. every coin that's on, very true. on Binance. But then once Binance US, they only had like a third of the coins, and their their service wasn't up to par to the actual Binance. That's very true. And uh, they just left us high and dry. And if you didn't get your stuff off, guess what? You was locked out of your account. Locked out of your account. And uh, yeah. they didn't care. So, but you know what though, man? I, so I don't also, try to come back now. I blame I also blame that on the United States just dragging its feet on this crypto dragon revolution dragon. man yeah they definitely drag they, feet. like we, what people don't understand though the so the united states once again is losing the world currency uh head or the 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 reserve currency right and what they're trying to do overall is the other country united states here the rest of the world is here all right they're trying to let the rest of the world catch up before they unleash the united states mm-hmm. because we have the, the strongest economy. We right. if, if you if true. you if you open this up to us too fast, to, the, there's no way the rest of the world is catching up to us. If if because they're trying to put us on an even playing field. Right. And if right now if one they were band, to, one sound. yeah, and like I said, they're just trying to kick that the regulations down, down the road, down the road to let the rest of the world catch up. And then once they're maybe caught up or maybe surpass us a little bit, then they're gonna take those reins off of us and let us fight and, and and catch up to the rest of the world and then we, once again we'll be at an even playing field across the, all the nations and and then that that new world currency and all that stuff new will, world currency new world go order. down but until then yeah. like i said they're gonna keep regulations on it they're not they're not gonna give us that bitcoin etf they're not going to make any true regulations right now and so then yeah. and we just gotta sit back and wait but while we're waiting we should be buying we should, should be buying dollar cost averaging dollar cost averaging you know I mean? um building your portfolio build your portfolio you know I mean? get into the different sectors right. you got gaming we got utility we got you, ai yeah understand what you want Huge. to invest in right. understand what you're investing in understand that you're investing in your future understand that we are possibly going into a cashless recession within the next two to three years so how are you going to navigate that right. with digital assets right digital dollars digital money Get you get you a, a, a glint account so you yeah. can start buying some actual gold yeah. and use your glint debit card to allocated gold mm-hmm. stored the, save the dollar you. is you get your own the dollars done you people your crypto card but you get your own debit card you can spend it it's not part of the actual financial system so for some reason if you can't use your cash or your regular credit card you can always use your glint card there you go you buy some gold. gold yeah yeah 
get you a Coinbase card, spend your digital assets as yeah. a, as you should. I mean, you know, it's 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 crazy out here, man. You know, it's a bear market. You know, the market is, is down right now. We're ha we've had a nice little meme coin craze as of late. You know, it's a lot. It's been a lot of you know big gains in the Pepe coin and in the meme space. And, and they're throwing but, these coins out there for you so you can chase the new stuff and not stay focused. Not stay focused on, on the prize. Your XRP, your XLM, your you know H bars, your V chains. Yeah, you know what I mean? Your coins that's going to change the world in the next couple of years. So, I mean, guys, you got to wake up. You yeah. know, head yourself against this recession. Definitely. Follow the Maryland for Crypto show. You are, you Make know. sure you stay on top of mm -hmm. all of our different um, platforms. We're on Instagram. We're on Facebook. We're on Twitter. Make sure you follow us. All of us. And we're on everything. We're on it all. And check us out. Maryland for Crypto, like you said, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Yeah, I mean, you can even donate to us the Maryland for Crypto Cash App. We'll take it. You feel me? Exactly. We got the YouTube channel. Right now, the uh, Maryland Crypto uh, Patreon, where we're trying to rebuild that, get some new content out. You know what I mean? Got our LinkedIn page. You can reach out. And you already know. Fooby. Fooby. You can Shout always jump on Fooby. And make sure you, man, like and subscribe to the page, man. We're trying to finally, you know what I mean, take it serious, get, get, get to a thousand viewers or followers, you know what I'm saying? And, and do this thing the right way, man. We just dropping this dollars to you. Definitely. Hey, man. Thank y'all for tuning in. Yep. To the Maryland for Crypto show. We always bring you that heat. That fire. Stay tuned for the next episode. You're already. Hey, yo, drop that. Drop that. That's good. Folks feeling like I ain't done much. All good, though. I know I did everything I could, though. Insisting anyway, like Rondo. Rage on, bro. I'm kicking shit like E Honda. I gotta eat every plate made for me, Casa. Talking dumb to me, mean I gotta holler. You focus on memes, me, I'm talking dollars. Bruh, uh. We riding on dope ass energy. We rolling up dope, stay away from me. My shit is too dope, you can't cope with me. Fuck you if you can't deal with my energy. We rolling off dope ass energy. We rolling up dope, stay away from me. If you can't deal with my dope energy, fuck you and anything that you feel about me.